Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, you guys, I'm having another seafood boil. Um, it's a big one, you guys. On the menu today, of course, I have my big old king crab legs. I have my black Prince Edward mussels. I have some corn on the cob. I have some potatoes. I have some jumbo tiger prawns. I have some boiled eggs and oh and I have some lobster tails this is my seafood boil sauce that I normally make you guys I will put the recipe in the description box below because I'm always asked um, what's in the sauce of course for those that know me I have my crusty bread I have some sourdough bread here I like sourdough bread with my um, seafood boils to drink you guys I'm going to have a mango mango bubbly I should have poured that already what are you guys eating with me my apologies that this video is coming out later than it normally does I normally post really early in the morning um, <clears throat> I, it was like kind of a change of plans. I was supposed to do the seafood boil yesterday with my family, but they got caught up in the hair salon. Ladies, you know how it is. When you're going to the hair salon to get your hair done on a Saturday, you're there all day long. So um, I didn't get to do the seafood boil with her, so I'm doing it today. Today is Sunday, and hopefully I can get this video out today. I'm going to try my hardest. Whew. One, I'm excited. Two, I am hungry. Ooh, and that sauce, y'all, and that sauce. Mmm. Okay. Ooh. Mmm. Yes. I make the sauce a little bit spicy today. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mm. I made it a little bit spicy because I made a huge batch. Hey guys, I'm back. Sorry. That spice had kicked me all up in my throat. <clears throat> all in the back of my throat. Mmm. <clears throat> no, she never can. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Let's get to the main event. <clears throat> I can cut my crab. Normally I cut the I slit it so it's not so hard to break. I'm gonna do this a little bit different, you guys. Normally I don't do it this way. Normally I don't keep this on. But I'm going to this time. So you guys. <clears throat> For all of my new subscribers that have not um, seen any of my seafood boil videos, I have a whole playlist, you guys. A whole playlist full of seafood boils. So when you get a chance, go ahead and check out those videos. My sauce is really spicy, you guys. I made a whole bunch because I was making some for my coworker. Now she is allergic to seafood but she wants to eat it with the corn and potatoes. There we go. You gotta get all up in there. Get all up in there, get all that goodness on it. <clears throat> I hope I don't make too much of a mess. Mmm, mmm. 
And ginger. Oh, I bet heck of garlic, y'all. Mm. That was good. Like, really good. Ooh. Mm. <clears throat> Did I ask you guys what y'all was eating with me? I don't remember. It is nice and spicy, but it's so good. I think I may have made it a little too spicy for my coworker. Her spice level kind of is a one. <laughs> and this is gonna be too spicy for her, but she's gonna like it. It is good. Come on out, baby. Uh, got it in there. There we go. There we go. This goodness right here. If it is still Sunday, I'm going to try my hardest to upload this video today, you guys, Sunday. But it kind of all depends on editing, how fast it'll upload, all that good stuff. But if it is still Sunday, how many of you guys saw Lady T on B Love's channel this morning? Mm. Sorry. Now I'm going to fail. Yeah, I'm bit right into a shell. Sorry, guys. Potato. I'm not eating too many of these potatoes. They're dangerous. Mm. They're so good. Mm. Mm. So did y'all see them this morning? That was such a good collab. I love me some lady team. Lady T says you gotta get on that flavor train, y'all. Mm. 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 This is so good. No wonder this is what I've been into. There's a dog on shell in here. <clears throat> you know you guys too many of my muscles didn't open. And that drives me crazy. I don't like that. Let's get into some of this bread. Sourdough bread. <clears throat> mm. Mm -hmm. Do me a favor, you guys. Ooh. 
spicy. Do me a favor and share this video. Help this video go viral. To all my peeps out there, my family. Mm. Mm -hmm. These shrimp are cooked perfectly. I did a good job. If you guys can hear. Mm -hmm. Talking in the background. Please excuse me or excuse it. <clears throat> it is the fam bam having a conversation. Gotta get into, get into this good stuff right here. Oh, look at that. Can y'all see that? <clears throat> now I know this is gonna make a mess. Mm. TV yelling at poor, poor old Steph Curry. Leave that man alone. He playing the best he can. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Corn is so good you guys can y'all see that egg uh oh almost lost it mm. guys my cousin that was supposed to be doing this um seafood boil with me had asked me she was like because you know she's watching mukbangs she was like why do they put eggs in it and i said because it's delicious that's why it's so good she was like really and i'm like yes so i had made sure i had went out and got some eggs because I wanted to, um, wanted her to experience it with the eggs. Oh, excuse me. My apologies, you guys. I wasn't ladylike. Mm. Oh, man. You guys, I have on a really pretty purple summer dress. You guys can't really see it, but... It's really cute. I just got some sauce on it. Ooh. You guys, crispy bacon. Oh, there he is. He down here somewhere. Mmm. Mmm. Guys, don't forget to thumbs up this video, comment down below, subscribe if you haven't already done so. On the side of the subscription button is a notification bell. Hit the bell to be notified every time I upload a video.
But my day ones, do you guys remember this? My bad. My old, old school water jug. I used to only pull it out when I did seafood boils. Mmm. This is so good. So good. If you're not putting eggs in your seafood boil, you're missing out. I'm hungry today, you guys. <clears throat> so for my... Subscribers that watch, <laughs> I can't see y'all. For those of you that watch Survivor, mm. Mm. the shrimp is good. Um, Survivor, you know I was upset when they voted off my boyfriend with his little cute stuff. That's right, he'll be back. Ooh, corn, corn, corn. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. So sweet. Mm. <clears throat> mm. The only bad thing is it gets stuck on open your teeth. Um, but I'm happy you guys, corn is back. <clears throat> you know, we have a lot of uh, farms over here, not too far from me. can get fresh corn, fresh, fresh corn from farm to table. Ouch. Good, you guys. You know what I used? Um, dang, that was good. I used unsalted sweet cream butter this time. Normally I use salted, but I was at Costco and I wanted a big, like a whole bunch of butter because I knew I was making a lot of the sauce. Like, I made this. I have a whole nother big one that I'm going to throw in the freezer. And then I have a whole container to take to my coworker. 
So I bought a lot of butter. <clears throat> but I got the unsalted, which I, I think I prefer the unsalted to where you can, you know, make it as salty as you want to. Because sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes king crab can be a little salty. So um, normally I don't put salt in my sauce because normally the crab is just a little already salty. But this is perfect. I did add a pinch of salt though. It's a pinch. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's good. Baby. I wish I had a fork. Because I want to get this potato all up in the bottom. I don't like getting my fingers hecka dirty. I normally eat these later because it's a lot of meat and it is really good <clears throat> but I know um, I get full really quickly when I eat that part I'm gonna save this one for the fam bam Guys, I just want to tell y'all that I appreciate you guys. Everybody that's watching right now. And if you're watching and you haven't had a chance to subscribe, you probably should. I feel like there's sauce on my chin. Normally you can't feel it, but this is a thick one. Oh, okay, big boy. Let's get all up in it. I want y'all to see. I'm making a mess, you guys. Look at all that goodness. All this is garlic, ginger, parsley, seasonings, lemon, deliciousness and love. It's the Nico Yum Yum way. Mm-hmm, mm. Tangy from that lemon. I know a lot of you guys ask me about the lemons that I have because I always have lemons. They are just for presentation. That is all. I normally don't do this. lemon ring because I have a lot of lemon juice in this sauce I put I squeezed six Meyer lemons which was super duper juicy so I don't need, really need any more lemon juice mm. Mm. I'm happy I'm so happy right now If you've never done a seafood boil before, you gotta do one. You gotta. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna scoot some of this stuff over. Just know that when you do a seafood boil afterwards, you're gonna be sleeping. I didn't know I'm gonna be sleeping. 
which is not a good thing because I'm making ice cream. I'm making ice cream today. I think I'm gonna go do strawberry or strawberry or a berry. Like a mixed berry. So I still have to go get the fruit. I was thinking about a mango. I try bread too, you guys. I don't know. I might be the only one that does bread with their um, seafood boils because I'm addicted to bread. But it's really good. Really, really, really. Camera might cut out on me, you guys. Time is ticking. My apologies for such a long video. But I'm, this is good. And I'm gonna eat till I can't eat no more. I'm not gonna stuff myself. I'm gonna eat till I'm uh, comfortable or full. eggs and potatoes you guys delicious we all know that king crab is the star of the show for seafood boils but if you can't have it or if you just don't want to spend that much money on some seafood corn, eggs, potatoes. You will not be disappointed. Mm. 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 way more water than I normally do. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. And I know this water is what's making me cool. Or, you know. Mm. 
I should make a seafood sandwich with this bread. Mm. Getting full, you guys. <laughs> I don't think I can do anymore. Maybe a muscle. That's a little. And the fam bam doesn't care for muscles, so. Well, my brother likes them now. But everybody else just won't eat them. <clears throat> this is flavored and seasoned so good. I seasoned my water a little bit differently this time. <clears throat> Normally throw Old Bay in my water, but I put Old Bay Creole seasoning and uh, garlic powder. It came out really good. Mm -hmm. Michelle. <sighs> I did not. He showed that shrimp before popping it in my mouth. One more bite. Just a bite. Mmm. Mmm. Amazing. Woo! Night, night time. But I really need to go to Sprouts and get those berries. I was going to get the strawberries from, um, you know how you um, see, um, sometimes people standing on the corner that are selling fruit? I was going to get it from him because, you know, I wanted to help him out. I'm always going to try to help out if I can. But man, when I tell you he was jacking up that price, it was like, you're taking advantage now. Like, you don't like strawberries, really, and especially those little video of, um, mangoes from, like, the little Filipino mangoes. Not the big, big ones. He had a box of those, and I was like, dude, you are way overcharging for some doggone fruit when I know I can go down the street to Sprouts and get this fruit. Like, because I live so close to farms, it's too easy for me to get fruit, fresh fruits and vegetables. So I was like, no, buddy. He's like, oh, I need to eat. Okay, but charging an arm and a leg for a box of fruit, I'm starving. You have a whole bunch of fruit in front of you. I don't think you're starving. <clears throat> and I get it. I guess you can't eat your product or whatever. I don't know. But, like, I just felt like he was taking advantage. And I was like, really? You must not know. I'm going to go, you guys. Because. Yep. I'm going to go. Hmm. So, if I do head out I might vlog and I think I might record me making the ice cream I'm not sure yet maybe or maybe just eating the ice cream I wanted to do a strawberry ice cream with a like a strawberry puree drizzled in like swirled in it with a Nutella swirl chocolate covered strawberries doesn't that sound good you guys if I do do it um I'll try to film it. This is my first time making it like this, so it might turn out crap. <laughs> I don't know. Um, so I'll try to film it. If not, uh, film it, then I might do a quick little dessert mukbang with it. I don't know. And I purchased, I don't know if you guys remember, or 
I did a birthday shout out um, for Nicholas White, my day one. And I had this lemon cake that I bought to celebrate his birthday to wish him a happy birthday. I went back and got that cake again because that cake was so good. Like, my family tore it up. I heard my sister was tearing it up too while I was at work. Um, but I bought another one <clears throat> that I will be taking a piece of. So, sissy, baby sister, if you're watching this, I got the lemon cake. Come on over, get some. Um, I think, I believe she watches my videos. I don't know if she watches all the way through, but I believe she does. All right, guys, let me go. Once again, thumbs up this video. Comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. On the side of the subscription button is a notification bell. Hit the bell. My bad. Come back and join me for another mukbang, a cook with me, an ASMR video, or a vlog. Feel free to share my videos with your friends, your family, your co-workers, your loved ones, your neighbors, the mailman, with anybody. Um, you know, tell them to come over here and check out what I'm doing over here. Mm -hmm. Little Miss Miko Yum Yum. And uh, I want to say welcome to my new subscribers. I appreciate you guys subscribing to this channel. I hope that you guys are enjoying this content. As far as seafood boils go, I know that a lot of people like to see seafood boils. Um, I typically only do them once a month. Um, Sometimes a couple times a month, depending on if I have people with me. But if it's just me by myself, it's only going to be once a month. Um, like the next one will probably be with my cousin that didn't get to do this one. So it might be coming a little sooner. <clears throat> um, and I don't think anybody would be mad about that. I'd like to say uh, thank you to my day ones and my loyal viewers. You guys are amazing. I appreciate the support that you guys give me. Love you guys to pieces. I really, really do. I want to give a shout out to James Charles in that Morphe palette, baby, because you guys see. I love playing in makeup, you guys. And I love playing around with all these bright colors that typically I would never really wear, really wear all the time. But I figured I was putting on a purple sundress. Uh, why not play in some purple eyeshadow? Um, okay guys, let me go ahead and go. Oh, don't forget to, well, uh, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and oh, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and Facebook, all under the name Miko Yum Yum. Um, if you share my videos, just tag me to let me know that you're sharing them on your platform. I appreciate and love every last one of you guys. Come back and join me. This Cebu Boy was the bomb.com. And, um, yeah, I'm going to go because I'm nice and satisfied and I have so much sauce that I need to pack away. And the sauce is also freezable, you guys. You can throw it in the freezer. Just make sure that it cools completely down because right now it's not hot, hot, but it is, it's very warm to the touch. You want it to cool completely down before you throw it in the refrigerator or before you throw it into the freezer. It's kind of like gumbo. Let it cool down before you toss it in. Okay, guys. I love you. I will see you guys on the next video. Come back and join me. Thumbs it up. Comment. Subscribe. Share. 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 And guess what? Share. See you guys on the next video. Bye, guys. Mwah. Bye. <laughs> Bye, guys.